Today we're going to talk about how to use Ispionage's landing page intelligence to get insights for how to improve conversion rates for your own PPC campaigns. And to get started, we're going to use the example of GoDaddy. That's uh, an example we've used a lot. Um, so I put in GoDaddy.com here, then I click search. And uh, once you get to the results, um, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click on the landing pages tab. And so we'll go here to the landing pages tab. And this section shows us um, not only what landing pages GoDaddy.com is using for their campaigns, but it also shows us which keywords and which ad copy they are grouping with those landing pages. So we have the keywords, we have the ad copy, and we have the landing pages. And um, what you want to do is you want to um, click through different competitors, different advertisers, to see what they're doing to convert their traffic and to see what you can learn from their landing page design, their offers, their call to actions, things like that. And once you see a page, you can click on it and uh, you can actually see a full version of the page by clicking in. And so what we have here is one of GoDaddy's landing pages. Um, they're using this one for terms like $1 domain, buying web domain, etc. cetera. Um, we see their offer. Their offer is compare and save big, 99 cent dot com domains one per customer hurry get yours now they allow you to search for a domain um, so they're doing a couple things here first of all they're offering a offering a really low price on a domain to convince people to buy a domain and then secondly they're they're using the search function to get people to get started by searching for whatever domain they're looking for and interested in and um, so in this example um, you might learn that okay uh, actually what good is doing even though they're a hosting company they're offering cheap domain names as a lost lead uh, because you know once you sell a domain name to someone, you have the opportunity to upsell them hosting services. You have the opportunity to upsell them web security, um, web design, email and office, and things like that. Um, so <clears throat> the name of the game here is to get customers in the door, get them to buy a 99 cent domain. Once they've spent that money, once they become a customer, then you have the opportunity to sell them more products and more services. Um, okay, so then you know you can look down here and see the other things that they've done and see if there's anything um, you can learn from the design. For example, they have 24-7 support, phone number up here. Um, there's just different things you can scan and learn. And um, so that's an example of what you can do. You can study your competitors' offers, their design, uh, their their conversion strategy in GoDaddy's case they were converting um, people to trying to convince people to do a search um, you know versus a free trial or something of that nature and what you can do is you can also see um, other you can view these pages in a um, we have we're looking at a list view before now we're looking at it in the tile mode um, so you can browse through all their landing pages fairly quickly to see what other designs are they using, what other landing pages are they using. Okay, this one looks interesting, let's check this out. Um, okay, so this is a similar offer, 99cents.com uh, domains, one per customer. Uh, looks like they're checking, testing a different design here. So by scanning their different landing pages, we were able to check that out. Um, so uh, yeah, so that made it really easy to look at GoDaddy's landing pages to get a quick grasp of what types of pages they're using, what types of offers they're running, things like that. You can also click on, the, click on the competitors tab here, and this allows you to see all the landing pages from other advertisers. Um, so you can scroll down and you can see what types of offers, what types of conversion funnel funnels are other um, pages using, other hosting companies. Okay, so this one, Rackspace.com, let's say they're a direct competitor of ours. Um, I'd like to click on them to see how they are converting their traffic. Uh, so they're using kind of a standard um, lead gen landing page, um, validated architecture designed to minimize downtime, DR to the cloud best practices. I don't even know what that is. Um, but really all of their emphasis here is on the lead gen form. So as compared to um, GoDaddy's approach, which is selling domain name, um, they are doing this approach of generating leads that they can follow up with. Um, a little bit of copy here, a little bit of explanation, uh, pretty simple, straightforward landing page. And um, so you may be interested in creating a page like um, GoDaddy's and, and learning from their conversion strategy, or you may find something from a site like Rackspace and you might learn from their conversion strategy. Um, so as we've seen, um, Ispionage makes it really easy to survey the landscape 
to quickly look at landing pages from different advertisers so that you can gather insights for your campaign and so you can consider other strategies. Um, so maybe you realize you need to update your landing page design. Maybe you realize you need to, to implement landing pages because your competitors are all using landing pages and you're still dropping traffic on your homepage. Um, or maybe you just learn a different type of conversion funnel. So you've been doing a lead gen campaign like Rackspace does. Uh, but then after kind of looking at all the different landing pages, you realize maybe you'd like to try an approach like GoDaddy where you sell something cheap first and then you do an upsell later. Um, whatever it ends up working out, um, this type of information is only available from Espionage. Espionage is the only company that's grabbing screenshots of competitor landing pages that make it really easy to survey the competitive landscape to learn what type of copy other sites are using, what type of call to actions they're using, and then so you can just um, <clears throat> use that to come up with ideas for your campaign. And something else we'd like to talk about is that um, it's great to spy on other competitors, especially ones with very large budgets. So let's say you don't have the time or the money to run that many A-B tests and optimize your own pages. Uh, but you can actually piggyback off of some of the testing efforts and some of the learning things that uh, other bigger companies have learned through um, you know, maybe CRO consultants or um, CRO teams that have worked for them. And so by using this information, by surveying other competitors, by studying what they're doing and how they're, they're um, converting their traffic, you'll learn some things that you don't want to do and you'll say, okay, I don't like this approach. But you'll also learn things from other people that they may have spent thousands of dollars to implement, thousands of dollars to test and to find, and um, you, can, you can benefit from that and learn it um, in a couple of minutes and then implement a test on your site and you don't have to spend the thousands of dollars and hundreds of hours that other sites have to spend. Um, so that's the, the quick rundown on how to use Espionage landing page insights to gather intelligence for your campaigns and to improve your conversion rates. Uh, we hope it helps and if you have any questions, uh, feel free to get in touch. All right, thank you.